Hey, I'm Madison. And I'm Lisa. And we're back from our adventure in London, back in our home church in Fraserburgh. This week we're learning all about a time when Jesus went to a wedding. So open your Bibles at John chapter 2 and we'll read on. John chapter 2 verses 1 to 11. The wedding at Cana. Two days later, there was a wedding in the town of Cana in Galilee. Jesus and his followers were also invited to the wedding. When all the wine was gone, Jesus' mother said to him, They have no more wine. Jesus answered, Dear woman, why come to me? My time has not yet come. His mother said to the servants, Do whatever he tells you to do. In that place, there were six stone water jars. The Jews used jars like these in their washing ceremony. Each jar held about a hundred litres. Jesus said to the servants, Fill the jars with water. So they filled the jars to the top. Then he said to them, Now take some out and give it to the master of the feast. So the servants took the water to the master. When he tasted it, the water had become wine. He did not know where the wine had come from, but the servants who brought the water knew. The master of the wedding called the bridegroom and said to him, People always serve the best wine first. Later, after the guests have been drinking a lot, they serve the cheaper wine. But you have saved the best wine until now. So in Cana of Galilee, Jesus did his first miracle. There he showed his glory and his followers believed in him. Hey, so here we see that Jesus is attending a wedding. Have you attended a wedding before? Yes, I have. Quite a few? Yep. Yep, and I, I've even got a save the date for a wedding invitation. I just got in the door last week. Weddings happen all the time, don't they? And they're a real special occasion. Even here in church, we have many weddings throughout the year where people come and get married. We see here that Jesus also went to a wedding. And when he was at the wedding, this has never happened to me, but they ran out of wine. I've never been at a wedding where they've run out of food or run out of wine, but this happened at the wedding that Jesus was at. And Jesus' mother, she knew what Jesus was capable of. She knew he could do miracles. And so as Jesus was just going around his own business at the wedding, his mother came to him and says, Jesus, we really need your help here. And he hadn't done a miracle in front of other people at this point. This was the first miracle that Jesus would do. Well, after some persuading, Jesus went and he got the servants to get six stone jars, quite big jars, and fill them with water. Can you imagine what was going through the servants' head? Who's going to like drinking water? How is this going to happen? How is it all going to come together? But of course, when Jesus sent the water out, it had changed into wine. And the people at the wedding couldn't believe it. They couldn't believe that they'd saved the best wine for last. You know, Jesus does things that are beyond what we can imagine or comprehend. And it was an amazing first miracle. I'd have loved to have been there. Yeah. So this week, my challenge to you is just the same way as Mary, Jesus' mum, came and asked asked him to do the miracle. We can ask Jesus to do miracles in our lives. So this week, how about you ask Jesus to do a miracle or something amazing in your life and just see how amazing he can be. And we'll be excited to hear the stories. Yeah. Look forward to it.